Hey, welcome to this VHF UHF channel and a uh, little bit of information here concerning uh, listening online to frequencies and VHF UHF range. Although most of them are limited, uh, one of the places you can go to is WebSDR.org. Um, of course, every, a lot of you know the University of 20 shortwave receiver, which is amazing. But there are other receivers that do have frequency ranges that are in the VHF range. So if you go down the list, you'll notice that some will give you, for example, here some two meter frequency range, very small here, but uh, you know, you've got a, some VHF range here. If you go uh, down, you'll see some have UHF capabilities also, mostly in the amateur band for the most part, but check it out. You know, it's interesting. Uh, some have uh, amazing coverage, even though it's not that much, so here you got 401, you got 437, 439, you know, once again, limited, but still, you know, VHF, UHF stuff. Check it out, and why not tune the VHF ranges um, there? Some are even very, very interesting for the possibility of uh, tuning very high frequencies, like this is one, is a 10 gigahertz frequency, which is interesting. So check it out, like I said, limited ranges, but still. Could be interesting and you never know what you might hear check all the receivers and check the ranges from pretty much every receiver and you'll see some are more interesting than others and uh, you might be able to tune in different countries a little bit of uh, the shortwave or the vhf and uhf ranges see what you can hear on these receivers there's a lot of online receivers on the web sdr so you might find one that is interesting and has interesting broadcasts that you might want to tune in. If you enjoy my videos, why not subscribe to my channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, let us know. Give us a thumbs up if you like the videos. And I'll be posting the link to the WebSDR page in the description below the video. Thank you so much for watching.